ask all of you to put your hands together and give a warm round of applause to Brandon Hammett as a recipient of the annual Chuck Nozo Youth Legacy Award. Uh, you know, I, I it's hard to narrow it down to one thing, but certainly my, my eight years with uh, Pride um, and the work I've done, uh, you know, bringing Pride to communities across the county and making sure that uh, we're all united in that uh, front and uh, making sure that every voice is heard. He's an advocate for, again, an incredibly marginalized population in Simcoe County. But, you know, he's mobilizing, and you've seen Brandon grow over the years where, you know, he's now being involved politically to impact change. He's working with school boards. He's doing different pieces. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, they, they, you couldn't ask for two better recipients of that award. So, once again, I, I'm going to ask you to put your hands together and give a warm round of applause for Ethan Oblazinski as a recipient of the annual Chuck Nose of the Across the board, I mean, when I look at someone like Ethan, I mean, he's organizing fundraising for the new Building Hope campaign. He's instituting a lunch campaign that now feeds over 75 young people that wouldn't have lunch at school. And he did that all on his own accord. He wrote a grant. He went out and mobilized it. It started as a small little grassroots thing, and now again, you're feeding over 75 young people. I'll tell you that all of you and the Aurelia Youth Center have been embedded in my heart from the moment that I moved to the community, and. Um, speaking to Chuck through the years about the incredible work being done here, uh, I really didn't even have to ask him twice. Well, Chuck, as I, I can't say enough, thank you so very much. You truly are an inspiration, and the work you continue to do and the voice you carry will always guide us in our work. Please welcome educator and advocate Chuck Pinozo. I think um, it's amazing to see so many young people um, understand, you know, they are the future. I feel so uh, happy that I get you know, the hand, I get the hand of the torch of the next generation of black, um, dedicated um, young men and women. Um, who, uh, you know, can, can, can not just our rights, every, everyone's rights, so, and, um, they're smart and young and fresh, you know. <laughs> it, I, I, I hope I've made my mark. And um, as long as I live, um, I have a responsibility to use my celebrity. Um, it's like the uh, important. Uh, um. Brandon and Ethan both represent just, you know, what you see. And again, they speak for a lot of young people in our community and the amazing work they're doing. You know, selecting recipients for this award is never an easy task because the amount of good things that young people are doing in Aurelia. Really, and it, they both, on both ends of the spectrum, they represent that, how great young people can be and how they can impact change and motivate people to change and just to, to work to support others around them. They both exemplified that. That was pretty good.